forward, if we trust him, and if we if we'll just continue to follow him, then he will lead us in a way that that we'll, we will find that we have not only just enough, but we have abundance. We have more than what we need. More than enough for our lives. And, and as we've gone through this month, we've, we found that we've been trying to apply this, this abundance thinking to different areas of our life. We started with time. Well, we, started the, we had an abundance thinking attitude towards our time. I mean, how many of us have always thought, I never have enough time. There's never enough and there's just not enough time. You or someone else has said that, right? Ever heard that before? Wish I had more time. You know, and, and, and what we found was that, is that, it, that to sit there and say, well, I never have enough time or whatever, then, you know, that's scarcity thinking. You know, I remember, I think Zig Ziglar put out a little cartoon with a guy saying, you know, if, if, if there's a, if God